Hello! And hello to June. It's June, yay! June's my birthday mark, so I'm like, whoa! And uh, I woke up like so hyped this morning, and I was like, I just wanted to do a YouTube video, and I know I haven't done a video for like a while, or oh, I did actually, but I wasn't very good. But then, yeah, so I woke up this morning, and I kind of had a brain wave. I don't know, yeah, I just had a thought that like, made me want to do a YouTube video and I sort of remembered why I wanted to start doing YouTube videos in the first place and it was like to connect to people that I might not necessarily connect with on a day-to-day -day basis and not just that but to develop myself to get more comfortable with speaking even though I'm not speaking to anyone directly I actually find it quite hard to talk in a video especially when my mum's like I can see her there <laughs> And I feel like proper awkward, I look like I'm talking to myself, but yeah, and like, so yeah, and I just feel like so proactive today. Um, and there's been like loads of times where I felt like doing a video and I've been like, hmm, hmm, this, I shouldn't do it because of that. I've had like excuse arthritis. And do you know what, yeah, you've got to forget about them excuses and you've just got to do, when you want to do something or you have an idea to do something, you've just got to take action and do it. So yeah, and um, so I just wanted to just do a video, just do one. I mean, it's a beautiful day outside, it's the 1st of June, like I'm going to be 21 in 20 days, like I'm just doing a video, I'm taking action, I'm doing it, even though uh, like it's a bit uncomfortable as well. Like when I was doing like my fitness videos, it was a bit easier because I had something proper to talk about and I feel like I'm a little bit out of my comfort zone. So I'm just pushing that little boundary. But um, yeah, talking about like being proactive, I'm reading this book, Seven Habits of Highly Effective People. Let me just get it. So yeah, Seven Habits of Highly Effective People and um, literally the first habit, is being proactive so I'm like trying to practice that and it talks about like your circle of concern and your circle of influence like if you don't like something you either change it or change your attitude towards it because there's some things you know we can't actually change they're not within our circle of influence, we can't actually change it. But there's one thing we can always change and that is our feelings towards something. And that's like what I've learned and I've been trying to put in practice. And uh, I'm not saying it's easy because you know, we, sometimes we feel like our emotions control us, but we control our emotions. And it's just grabbing a hold of that and realizing that. And when you're in a situation where you notice that your feelings are taking over um, how you, um, act to some react to something then you can change it basically so yeah I've been working on changing either my approach to something or my feelings to something um, this book talks a lot about paradigm shifts which is like shifting your perspective on things and definitely reading the book I'm only like one chapter in and I need to like read it again but yeah like, pa like paradigm shift basically changing your view on something airplanes I don't know if they're disturbing yeah so changing your view on something and being proactive is like the first habit so uh, this is actually my mom's book and I'm gonna have to steal it permanently because I want to write in it and highlight stuff because I need like I need to highlight the bits that really stand out for me and um, so I'm gonna buy her another copy she doesn't know this yet she will after she watches this video but yeah so yeah so I just thought I'd jump on a YouTube video and I'm not gonna edit it I might edit it slightly yeah, so I'm gonna try I'm just gonna whack this on my feet my MacBook now upload it to YouTube and boom so do something today that your t tomorrow self will be grateful for yes and with that I'm gone